Okay, so print and cut adjustment for the end user. If you go to Rastlink and just find any print and cut uh, job that you have in the queue and then go to general print, when you've got a print and cut job, you can see that you get an extra tab, which is cut edit. In this tab, there's lots of things you can do. You can change the condition for the cutting you've got rather than changing it on the printer. So all those are quite self-explanatory settings really, but you need to go to print and cut adjust, origin adjust. And I would always recommend that you use registration marks because the, the accuracy of the cut is far better with, with them than without. Say okay, and then this is now going to send a job to the queue, which is a, it's going to print and cut this job and then we read it back and pick the best setting, which we'll uh, move on to shortly. Once it's done the print and cut, it's important not to take it off remote, otherwise you'll lose the opportunity to adjust it. So you press function one for adjust, uh, and in there you've got feed comp, PC origin offset, but the one we're doing now is TP offset. So just drop it down to TP offset and then right arrow, and then it'll feed it forward for you, which then you should be able to weed the centers out of the, uh, the box it's just cut. We all stay together, which is so you've got two adjustments, uh, X which is your feed and Y which is your scan. And basically when you do this yourself you'll see quite clearly you're looking for the, the most even cut uh, and the least amount of pink showing. So I would say for the X that is zero. So you've got 0, 0.00 so X is quite easy, it's zero. So drop down, press enter and then go to Y and then Y looks, I would probably guess, although it says one, two, three or on the actual print, you can actually go to half 0.5. So on Y, I'm gonna go minus 0.5. Now on this one, it's 0 0.5. You don't go 5.00. So it's gonna be 0 0.5. Press enter and then that's your print and cut adjusted.